Hi everyone and welcome back to the McCrazies. So I have a daughter that has to get a growth hormone shot and that is the Genotropin. It comes in a box like this. There's a pen that comes with it. You can change the casing here. Y'all, I have nails. I can't take that off right now. You can change the casing. They, they send you an extra one in a cap, maybe, depending on who your doctor is. And then there's the top for when you're actually giving the shot. So what I'm going to do right now is replace her genotropin. As you can see, the old one is out of there. I just finished sanitizing my hands. I'm going to open the box here. This is what it looks like. I'm going to take alcohol wipes, wipe this part off. This contraption actually goes on top of that. So I'm going to wipe this down because you want this stuff to be nice and sanitized. And then I have here a sterile needle. And just in case you guys didn't know, because I did not know this, but these needles actually have an expiration date. I'm trying to get the camera to focus, but it will not. Anyway, they have an expiration date. I don't know what happens to a needle once it expires, but you probably don't want to use it. So this you just twist on there. I'm going to take this little purple cap right here off and expose the needle and put the plastic cap back on. Then I'm going to get another alcohol wipe. Wipe down my genotropin. Also, this has to stay refrigerated. I'm going to push this red button to pop this button out and then I'm going to dial it all the way down. What that is doing is moving this, um, I guess you could say it's like a hydraulic. It's pushing it down. Once I get down to the bottom where it won't turn anymore, I want to align this line here with this line here and push it back up because what that's going to do is whenever I put these together and twist it all down, you'll see that the air will release. Okay. So we're going to open this, stick it through here, and then put this here and start to twist. Oh, wait, I'm sorry. You have to release that button again. I'm sorry, y'all. <laughs> release that button again or it won't go down. Now I'm going to take this off to expose the needle. Be careful not to poke yourself. I'm doing this so that you guys can see if any of the medicine comes out where the air is being released. Okay, now if you look here, you can still see that white powdery substance mixed with the liquid so whenever you twist this down it pushes it up kind of like a push pop y'all remember those you don't shake you gently rock to mix the powder and the liquid together i don't know why you don't shake that is just what we learned don't shake it It usually mixes together pretty easily, and then you check it to see if you have any more powder in there. And you see I have just a little bit of powder right here still. I'm going to check it again, and I don't. So now I'm going to push this back up the button back up to release that air that's off inside of there. Did you see the medicine come out? And that is how you load the pen. 
Um, it is not time for her shot just yet, but I'm going to go ahead and show you how you prepare for the shot. You just take this cap off, um, put the needle on there. Of course, you want to wipe it down with an alcohol uh, pad, this one. You put this cap on there. You would press this red button that you pressed a minute ago and then dial it to the right away from yourself where you'll see the numbers here and you dial it to whatever dosage your doctor prescribed or told you to uh, use and then you have to the rest I can show you later but anyway that is how you load and dial the genotropin growth hormone this has to stay refrigerated so I'm gonna go ahead and I'll show you how I dispose of my needles I always put the purple cap back inside of the clear and this is after I give a shot and all and then put it back on there twist and then take it off and the reason why I do that is because this needle is pretty hard to remove without that plastic cap and yes you can poke yourself once I'm finished with this I just you know, normally you don't have this until you reload, but I just put everything inside my alcohol wipe trash and roll it all up and throw it away. So I really hope this could help you guys. And if you have any questions, feel free to comment down below. Thank you for watching. I love you. Bye-bye.